Hey everybody, it's Dave Wills, the crime wrestling fan. From the internet, Tosh Photo, YouTube, and memes everywhere. That's right. I'm the Insta Room to me guy. And let me tell you right now, you are right now watching. Yeah, we went there on YouTube. Baby, independent wrestling is great wrestling. Oh God, great wrestling is terrible to me. So if in Texas football is life, then the lifeblood of Georgia is going to be independent wrestling. Now, wrestling has been in this town, or in this state, I should say, uh, for as long as anybody can remember. And we are in Canton, Georgia tonight as eight separate independent wrestling promotions get together to host one show. Seven separate title matches, one wrestler in two of them. So we're going to go in tonight and see what it's like when hell freezes over. You, you said you were an old WCW, WWE fan. Yeah, big who, time. Who, was a, who was a favorite of yours? Oh, up? man. Stone Cold, uh, The Undertaker, Kane, uh, Rey Mysterio Jr., Sting. Like so old school. Hidden that big attitude show, era. Rocco, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, cool. Goldberg is uh, my absolute favorite. And so the undefeated streak, he had that big, long undefeated streak. Yeah. When he lost it on the undefeated streak, I was young, so... I kind of like fell off wrestling after that. But. I'm here with the voices of Southern Honor Wrestling. Brendan Burton and Gerald. Um, guys, tonight it's eight separate organizations. It is uh, seven title matches. Eight title matches. Eight title matches. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Eight um, matches total. Eight, yeah, eight promotions. Uh, eight title matches. Yeah. It's going to be insane. It's going to be nuts. Absolutely nuts. I got I to gotta ask because... I said in my intro, the lifeblood of Atla of Georgia is independent wrestling. Oh yeah. We've got eight separate federations here tonight. What is why is Georgia wrestling the place to be? Why? I think on a whole other level compared to the rest of the, the, the states. I mean, all over the country, people always talk about what's come, what comes out of Georgia. You know, I mean, not only do we have the Nightmare Factory here uh, that's leading into AEW, but I mean, you got Southern Honor Wrestling, that's where we're at, Action Building, home of SHW, yep. and so many other great promotions. And tonight is special because eight of those promotions are here under one roof. It, it's unheard of. Yeah. You're talking, you hear about in the, in the you know, WWE, uh, AEW, in the larger wrestling world, there's been a lot of talk about the Forbidden Door, right? Yeah. Well, tonight, the Georgia Independent Wrestling Forbidden Door is being kicked open. Yeah. Blown apart. Yeah, it's yeah. going to be amazing, GB. Absolutely. You know, the thing about Georgia is, historically, Georgia has been the hotbed for the sport. When WCW was here, when the NWA was here, Georgia Championship Wrestling was here, it was the hotbed for the sport. It continues to be. And so all of these promotions coming together, it's amazing because when you take a look at what's happening in the NWA, in Ring of Honor, and Impact, and of course AEW and WWE, it's all centered with what's happening here in Georgia. Yeah. And so it's exciting, even in NXT 2.0, you've got folks that have been right here in SHW. Yeah. So I think it's amazing, if you want to see what's next and what's now, you got to be here in Georgia. Absolutely.
show tonight. It's been kind of crazy. Uh, some titles have changed hands. Uh, overall, the energy in, in the event is is through the roof. Uh, it's a good it's a good crowd. A little smaller than what I've seen here, but uh, there are some famous faces. We went there. We went here. <laughs> so um, you've been to the Southern Honor shows before. Absolutely. You've been to uh, the Tap Shop. Uh, Lap Long Cup getting resident. Yeah. So. Um, what do you think of the energy in here tonight? The energy's great. You got eight different promotions competing. I've been in the back a little bit. There's really not any, any, any turmoil. Everybody's getting along, just having a fun time and everything. The rest of the promotions got together to put on a show of a couple of guys who are just great gentlemen. Nick McDaniel and, and, and Myron Fancher. I've known them for years. Great dudes, man. You got a good podcast tapped up. Do a good job. Cover wrestling. Love wrestling. Great fans. Really have enjoyed it. I've enjoyed it. Seeing so many guys. It's been a while since I've seen them. Yeah. COVID and everything. A lot of people ain't been out. They're all about. This is just tremendous. Yeah. Tonight's energy has been through the roof. What do you think is the... Is, is tapped out the catalyst to bring eight different organizations? Because you said Cobb County residents. So we're talking like old school yeah. with the NWA and George K. Well, see, down here they had superstars of wrestling on TV with from 46 and yep. 69. Yep. So what you have is you have eight hours of wrestling. So even though I'm in the backyard of the NWA, I also love Memphis, Continental. Love getting uh, some Continental. I, I love some Memphis. I love some UWF, World Class. I got a little bit also. I was a real wrestling nerd back in 85, 86, 90. That was the good time. Oh, God. It still time. is. I still watch it on YouTube. So but it's just good stuff. It's, it's a couple of guys who really don't have an axe to grind. They really don't have an axe to grind. They just want to do a good show and do something special. And this is something special. You get there. They're not out there trying to get heat. They're not trying to get themselves. So they didn't want to be acknowledged during the show. And of course, Gary is. Gary is. Gary's Gary. So what he did, he did their thing, which I thought was tremendous. Because God knows they weren't going to do it, and I'm glad he did. Yeah. Because they they really have work to tell them. Nick Daniels was a hell of a job with this. And I thought I, I think the world of both of them. I'm proud of them, man. They, they did something right here. If you put on your first show, you make money. That's incredible, right there. Honestly, pretty pretty and amazing. You get people who are gonna really who really are enjoying it. the crowds. Just be having a great time. The crowds having a High fantastic energy, time. You had some things. You had Hanson's head shake. I mean, good stuff. Matt Hankins had a hell of a promo. Yeah. Great matches all over. I mean. Nothing, nothing is dragging. You had a. We've still yeah. got what four more titles. Yeah, had the PCW. Uh, what, 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 the, 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 the PCW viewers' choice to put on a teddy bear. I yep. mean, you know, Teddy Longbear won the belt. Go <laughs> Teddy Longbear. There you go. You know, but I mean, it makes it, it's good stuff. It makes sense. So, so I'm really happy time. to be be in wrestling, be around wrestling, be involved with it. I, I just enjoy being a part of the show. Thank you so much for my pleasure, me. brother. This Follow me, still real Dave on Twitter, Dave Wills, the crying respite. The OG of Crying Wrestling fans, mind you, the original since 2005, baby. We'll be back. Here I am with Alex. <laughs> I am one half of the All-Star Special. One half of uh, your, your viral tag team champions. Hugs in the back getting ready. You know, he's got to put Michael to sleep. But, uh, yeah, so Alex, uh, you've been all over the place watching all this independent wrestling. So what's your favorite promotion so far? 
Um, you know, I've been very fortunate to be here almost from the very beginning with Southern Honor. Yes. Um, but I grew up in Atlanta. So okay. I go back to Georgia Championship back in the 80s. Yeah. Um, so, I mean, it's really interesting. But I came here to talk to you, sir, because tonight you have a tag team title match. Okay. And I'm curious. I, one of the things I, I, I'm absolutely fascinated about is the, the, the experience of not only wrestling, but wrestling specifically in the action building. And I'm curious, you've been here, you, you've wrestled here for about a year now. Yes. Uh, ever since last year's Rumble Jack. Yes. Which you took my spot in, but that's okay. It was uh, worth it. <laughs> for one of us. Um, so I'm curious, what's it like, what's the energy like in the ring with the fans that kind of come here to watch? All right, so the one thing you ain't got to worry about is uh, anybody hearing what you're saying, because, uh, yeah, the, the crowd here at the Action Belt is hot. They are loud, they're responsive, but the thing is you got to keep them hooked. You can't just, uh, you know, can't just do everything up under the sun and not, you know, expect not to get anything out of it. So you got to be careful what you do here. The the fans here are ruthless, They're for, but also they're amazing. They'll give you every bit of energy they got, and you know what, I love being here in the Action Building. There's a very few places I actually love wrestling. Uh, action Building is pretty much one of the best ones I've been with a crowd uh, in terms of crowd size and sheer volume. I would say, yeah, this is probably one of the best places I've been at. It's fantastic. Um, who are you Who are you taking on tonight? Tonight we are taking on the undeniable Matt Hakins uh, is going to be managing his boys, Shane Marks and Brian Blaze, two tough competitors, two champions, wherever they've been. I tell you what, Brian Blaze and Shane Marks, they are legit. They are champions wherever they go. They've held gold everywhere they've been. And to say this isn't a tall task is an understatement. Those two men right there are tough, they are strong, and they are smart. I am a rookie here in this situation. Anytime this happens, I am the odd dog in the fight. So I'm going to have to keep scrapping, put my hands up, keep fighting. Um, Hank says he's going to take more than just our titles away. I don't know what that means, but uh, yeah, he ain't coming anywhere near these ice cold plates right here. We're going to still walk out your viral tag team champions. Matt Hankins, you may have given me everything in this business. You may have taught me a lot, but you can't take anything away. And I'll tell you that tonight as we prove it in the ring, in the action building. That's hold my beer, Hanson, and he's awesome. Hell yeah. Also, I need to go get another beer. Um, what's the one match that we need to look forward to the most? Well, selfishly, you know, I'm a bit of a homer, and we're here at the home of SHW. The SHW title will be on the line tonight. Yeah. Yep. I know one of your favorites, David Ali. One of my all-time favorites, oh, yeah. David Ali. By the way, didn't he, like, knock you around at one point? It's he... in my intro video, yeah, as a matter of fact. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so anyway, David Ali will be defending here tonight. That's, uh, I mean, it's a He's defending card. twice. Yes. He's defending twice, an yes. IWE title, yep. and then also the SHW title. So, I mean, it's a stack card, though. Any, any number of matches will be a main event at yeah. any other show. So. <laughs> say this one of the things I love about coming here is the fan reactions the fan aspect the crowd um, what is it about 
Southern Honor, Georgia Independent Wrestling in general that brings the fans out and brings the energy that, that guys like you bring? Well, for me personally, this man right here told me about Southern Honor, and then he passed it out to me. Yeah, this is one big family tree. So it's like an evolution yes. of fandom. Okay. Yes, yes. And he, actually, he brought his brother. Like I tell you, real big family tree. So you know, they, they told he told me about it, and then you know, I had to see him for myself. And luckily for me, it's still cage match, so that made it so much easier for me to be like, oh, so yeah. Well, we're fans of wrestling in general, as you can see, like Super Nerd Crew. So, so having great action in the ring, as well as great, this is by far the best production value here. So, yeah. So, just every every month, action. It's never, I haven't seen a bad match at Southern Art. No, I haven't seen a bad match at all. The storytelling aspect that they give here. Uh, is a uh, is a huge plus, uh, in, in my opinion. Is that what brings you guys back? Is it the action in the ring? Is it a combination? All is it the whole package? Yes, all, all of the above. Above. Hold, 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 hold this man's hand. hand. You gotta hold, hold his hand. hand. Hold Come on, what? I, I'm good. No, give see, I'm fine. No, no, fine. you're fine. You're fine. It's, yeah, fine. yeah, no. Um, now, I spoke with this man before the show. You came out with the titles. We still have them. We still got them. Really? We still have our titles. You know, and I, I quote the movie Dragnet, kids, it'll grow back. But you want them, don't you? <laughs> I'm bald, man. My girl going to see this. Hey, man. <laughs> Bitches love Tupac, man. You look good, Chapter. I hate Tupac. I mean, he was bald, too. A lot of motherfuckers are bald. I mean, yeah, yeah, I was bald, like, like since he was bald. I look like Jesus. Now you're making a lifestyle choice. Uh, yeah, it's Yes, well, ladies love a bald head. <laughs> Just please clean that up. Not his fault. Yes, not All his right. fault. Guys, yes, the story, the story's not there. <laughs> Again, that's 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 that same thing that we're that's just same, talking about. Uh, and, yeah, and, and they're you know genuine too. Like they love uh, the fans. You can tell. We just had a photo with Owen. Knight. Yes, he loves yes. us. Like, I just saw that we were in his uh, promo video. Yes, like, we were seeing. I was like, whoa! We were in Owen Knight. So anytime he comes here and plays. We're in all nights from one video, there so it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just, it's that, it's the interaction, it is a storyline, we're excited for uh, Story Hero 3, like, I mean, they, they just, we kind of wish it was more than just monthly, like, I almost wish it was bi-weekly kind of thing, you know? Yeah. Wouldn't that, could that possibly be overkill, though? No, there's some, uh, overkill, I see what you did there, ha <laughs> That would be great, I would love that. <laughs> Um, but yeah, crowd interaction is, is definitely a big key because they can easily just big headed and just ignore us the whole time while we're yelling and screaming at them and all that stuff. But once we see we get a reaction out of them and they come after the show and they're like, oh, I love you, man, or or oh man, I, oh you almost got you almost got us cracking up. Yeah, like it's, even when they're heels, yeah, and we're like, come on, we love you, take this love. They're like, no, no. <laughs> but um, yeah, no, so it's it's just a great great everything. You saw 10 matches tonight, and with that 24-7 rule, 164 title changes this evening. <laughs> right. What was match of the night? For me, it had to be between Joe Black and uh, uh, Joe Drake. Black and Joe Black match. Yeah, yeah. Drake and... Uh, what was the other one? The other one I was thinking about. Either the main event or it was something else. I can't do that. I'm going to go with Joe Black and uh, Drake, because that's the one I can really remember. Yeah, I, I, that and then runner-up was definitely uh, David Ali. And John Davis became a fan of John yes. Davis. Yes, stole mine. So I'll just go ahead and throw in that final that match, the Southern Fried Championship. That was everything. Cool. Gentlemen, thank you guys so much for for talking with me, and uh, we look forward to seeing you next show. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, in all the excitement of the show, I completely forgot to film an outro. <laughs> so I'm still learning. This is a new process, but I do want to thank everybody who's already given likes and subscribed to the channel. We obviously want to ask you to hit that like button, hit that subscribe if you haven't already, and tell your friends about us. Share it. We'd love to get more action. We'd like to get more uh, people watching. We'd like to get more interaction with you. So, what do you think of this week's show? Is this something that you'd like to see more of? And... What's your favorite wrestler of all time? Leave it in the comments down below. 
In the meantime, I'm Alex reminding you that everything is an adventure with the right people. So find your people. Take care. You said this is your first time ever going to a wrestling show? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, you said that you were an old fan way back in the day. WCW, WWF, stuff like that. Sure, sure. Um, what brought you here tonight? My boy, Victor. All right. Hi, Victor. Hello.